I am extremely honored to attend virtually to this forum. The scope and importance of the topics of discussion are not only relevant, but indispensable to move our respective societies to a full recuperation after the pandemic. Mexico has a strong connection with the Philippines, built upon many years of shared history, but also because we have many similarities. We stand proud in the world arena as rightful owners of strong cultures, rich natural resources, and a geography of incomparable beauty. As you well know, Mexico has a very active embassy in the Philippines under the guidance of Ambassador Gerardo Arredondo, who has made a fantastic job to underscore the strong ties between the two countries, especially on the historic link by virtue of which many trips of the Galeón de Malina took place, inaugurating a commercial route connecting Asia with Mexico and Latin America. As you well know, the Galeón de Manila Day is a UNESCO program which both countries fully support. I am posted now as ambassador of Mexico to Ghana, and in this region of the world, I have witnessed the importance that trade and tourism have for the development of countries. And now, after the pandemic, we need to unite efforts towards achieving the much needed economic recuperation we all need. But we need to do it responsibly and incorporating all sectors of society, including minorities, women, children, and certainly our youth. Tourism can be a very powerful tool to boost economic performance. But nowadays, it requires, or I should say, it demands comprehensive policies to facilitate travel. It is a must to create protocols of international observance, to enable travelers to move with certainty, and that they do not constitute additional barriers or make it incredibly expensive the possibility of traveling abroad. We have seen the tremendous distortion created after COVID-19 in the international movement of people and the tragic consequences for many families that depend upon the tourism industry. Mexico, as one of the most attractive tourism destinations in the world, is pushing forward new and ambitious strategies to bring the industry back to pre-pandemic levels. I am certain that we need to work to collectively to exchange experiences, best practices, and doing all at our reach to ensure that our countries develop at its fullest their tourism capacity. I see here in Western Africa the tremendous potential of tourism and the value of such activity to move people out of poverty. The world is a very small place and we need to make it accessible the ability of individuals to travel and to know the many wonders that the world has to offer. I encourage you to think in ways to enhance tourism as a tool for development of countries. And truly to do that, it is possible. And I do believe that it is possible if we understand the, that many things change after COVID and therefore we need to adapt and to meet the new challenges without hesitation creativity, imagination is a must in the world we're living in. And I'm pretty sure that the meeting of the minds that you are uh, proposing here today will achieve such a result. Thank you very much, and I hope that you enjoy the rest of the event.